हाउ टू टीच रामायण टू आवर चिल्ड्रन और हाउ टू लर्न इट बाई आवर सेल्फ रिमेंबर दैट रामायण ऑफ पीपल मे से इट इज द स्टोरी अदर्स कैन से इट इज द हिस्टोरी बट हिस्टोरिकल फैक्ट्स विद लिटिल एक्सैजरेशन has been explained like story that is called ramayana when you are writing gayatri mantra from top to bottom 24 letters are there these 24 letters are converted into 24000 shlokas why by valmiki maharshi remember that valmiki himself was a burglar in the forest namely ratnakara he himself got converted from a burglar a uh, position to a great rishi and we cannot uh, see a guru was there for uh, valmiki maharshi the manifestation of the knowledge which is already within him that he wrote as 24000 shlokas for the common man valmiki maharshi was advised by narada maharshi to simplify the vedic ramayana deva ramayana to valmiki ramayana for the common man experiencing how to live in this world if the god himself uh, take a birth as a human being if the god himself is taking birth as a human being how he should deal with his parents how to deal with the wife how to deal with the children how to deal with the brothers how to deal with the friends how to uh, deal with the gurus how to behave with the enemies how to take the help of others and how to help others how to rule the nation how to give positives to the citizens of the people and as as not as a ordinary man but as a as a king in a great country as the son of great dasharatha maharaja having three wives of each one kausalya gave birth to sri rama so ideal family relation ideal personal management ideal family management ideal cultural management ideal social management and national management managing everything connected with an individual particularly for a king this is the largest uh, circumference and the largest uh, diameter as far as the life of an individual is concerned how we have to learn it what i would like to say it is the last class i was explaining that whenever you are teaching the management it is the mental attitude it is the mental approach it is your vision it is your mission it is what you think it is the mental approach everything counts when you are managing something internally or externally managing something within yourself managing something within your family managing something within the society managing something within the part of the nation other nation our nation and so on and this we can explain to any rulers to any managers to any chairman to any individual to any leader by taking example from the people who lived a long back and who were living near nearby la past uh, nearby years and who are living now so the history or the experience of the people who lived a long long back as far as ramayana is concerned you can see that when the life and the total experiences explained belongs to treda yuga so how each individual uh, was living and the group as a family living and so on here we can see that the experience of sri rama you have to learn by yourself and also teach your children experience of a mother experience of a brother experience of a father everything and most important as far as valmiki ramayana is concerned how sri rama is discussing with the lakshmana how sri rama guiding bharata how sri rama was getting the guidance from dasharatha how sri rama or others getting the guidance from kausalya mandara kaigeyi or for that matter bali getting advice from his uh, wife what uh, sugriva is getting advice from lakshmana or tara and so on here exactly just like we are uh, watching a movie or watching a drama or watching a serial in the tv the discussion among the people and between the people maybe 
enemies, maybe friends, maybe parents, maybe family members, maybe blood relatives and so on. Take every message from them, the positive or negative, the ego of Ravana and the simplicity of Vibhishana and the confusion of Kumbhakarna and what happened to Bali, why it happened and the advice given by Tara to her son, all these points. I would like to say the messages uh, that we have to extract from the discussions between the people and also among the people. The, the messages that we have to take up from the discussions between the people and among the people. That you can see that that is what we have to take in the 21st century after subjecting them to addition, deletion, modification and correction. Addition, deletion, modification and correction because we are living in the 21st century. We are not living in the Treda Yuga. We are neither living in the Dwapara Yuga. So we are living in the 21st century and all the most modern systems are existing here of which any message given at any period of time for anyone can be of some use for us if we are subjecting those messages uh, to addition, deletion, modification and correction. Some of the stories may also be there as I explained to you in the Puranas stories are given from the stories we can learn the management of life from Mahabharata stories are there and also explanations experiences are there events are there messages are there truth and fact about the life are explained in Mahabharata just like that in Valmiki Ramayana which is Adi Kavya might have written thousands and thousands of years ago by Ratnagara after himself converting into a great Rishi. The change took place in an individual and that changed individual has written what is meant by a Madhyada Purusha. Madhyada Purusha means an individual who is thinking about himself, who is thinking about his family as a member, who is thinking about the social member and who is thinking about a, 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 an individual living in a nation as a king surrounded by so many others. Uh, how to value the opinion of the citizens, how to value the opinion of his family members, the society and how to value the opinions, suggestions, guidance, directions of the enemies. All these factors we can understand just like we are watching a movie or a serial or something like that. So you can see that how that Ramayana is impressing Indians and people world over. Right from the eastern part of Asia, from uh, Japan you can see, Malaysia you can see, Indonesia, Taiwan, Vietnam, Burma, even Bali, Dweeb, even Hanuman means Hanuman, the word itself is derived from Andaman, Andaman. So remember that all these east, uh, eastern countries of Asia, including India, and uh, in China and other, uh, Nepal, Bhutan and other places, Ramayana, which might have got written during Treda Yuga, has got a serious impact and influence. That is what we should understand. Every word given in Ramayana, every message given in Ramayana, if anywhere any story is mentioned, that content of the story and the messages from the story is to be taken. The experiences of the individuals. The positive experiences, the negative experiences of the individuals, whether it is Lakshmana, Bharata, Shatrugna, Sita Devi, Sumitra, Kausalya, Mandara or Dasharada, you take for that matter any one, any one, any one in Ramayana, their messages, their experiences, what they said, what they say, what they were uh, interested in telling, all these should be taken just like it is happening to us or to the people who are working with, with us in our company or our superiors or our inferiors, our subordinates or supervisors or our colleagues, then extrapolate or intrapolate it in such a way that Ramayana will be useful for moving yourself from Asadoma, Sadgamaya, from bad to good, good to better, better nearer to the best. From Tamasoma, Yodhirgamaya, from darkness to light, you can move and also from Mrityu or Ma Amrdangamaya, from a tensionful life, you can leave yourself to the tensionless life. This is what we have to learn from Ramayana. It's not for going to heaven. 
it is for creating a heaven in your mind it's uh, for creating a heaven in your family it's for creating a heaven in your own uh, institute in your own group in your own uh, organization in your own uh, movements uh, in your own party and also in our own nation that is what uh, uh, mahatma gandhi said that rama rajya and so converting the nation from an ordinary rajya ravana rajya to rama rajya converting a ravana rajya to rama rajya how it is possible that is explained in ramayana if you can understand the story small stories explained there and also the messages and truth and fact explained in ramayana thank you very much pranams to you